Hi, so in the last little while I've had two clients uh, tell me how hard it was to peel an avocado. And I thought that was weird because I've never actually tried to peel an avocado. Um, so when I was asking them about it, they, they told me they were actually trying to peel it like a, like a potato. So uh, I thought I'd show you uh, the simplest way to, to open and get into and use your avocado. Um, before I describe that to you and show you, um, I just want to show you how to determine if your avocado is ripe. Um, so there's a couple different ways. Um, when you grab it at the store, if, you, or if you're looking for a ripe one, it should give a little bit when you press down. So not rock hard, but if it's too soft and your fingers can like make a full indent, then that's way past ripe. You just want it to be able to give just a little bit when you press into it without leaving an indent. Um, so the other way is if you're not quite sure if it's gone bad or if it's still okay, you can kind of just pull off the little top here. <laughs> and if it's still nice and green, then it means it's still good. Um, if it's all brown and yucky, <laughs> just leave it at the store. Um, it's not gonna taste very good. So, Moving on, um, actually one more thing, <laughs> if you buy an avocado and it's not ripe and it's still really really hard, just leave it out on your counter and in about anywhere from two to probably four or five days, just keep checking it every day. Um, once it's a nice ripeness, you can store them in the fridge and they really won't ripen much after you put them in the fridge. So that's what I do, I buy a whole bunch, keep them in my fridge um, once they're ripe and you always have avocados. <laughs> Alright, so opening the avocado, <clears throat> all you got to do is simply start at the top, press the knife in, make a nice circle, go all the way around, cutting it directly in half. Then all you got to do is twist it, pull it across, pull it in half. So one side's going to have the seed, um, the other side's going to be just about ready to go. So. You can do two things with the seed, you can kind of jam your knife into it, twist and pull out, or if you want, which I end up doing, <laughs> it's a little more messy, but you can just scoop the whole thing out <clears throat> with a spoon and just pull it off. So then you got your avocado out. <clears throat> you can just scoop it off the seed with a spoon too. So you don't even have to touch it and get your hands dirty. <laughs> All right, so the other way, a little bit cleaner. <clears throat> um, probably just to, you know, stick the knife in, pull the seed out. And then what you can do, cut it into quarters with the, with the skin still on. Then once you got your quarter like this, all you're going to do is grab one side, kind of like you're peeling an orange, and just peel it back. This is a lot less messy. <laughs> Alright, so then you got this nice chunk of avocado. No mess. Um, you're not losing half of it trying to peel it like a potato. Um, yeah, and if it's, a, if it's a good ripeness, it peels really, really easy. So. Hopefully you learned something, or hopefully you had a good laugh watching me get dirty from my avocado. So, um, yeah, thanks for watching.